Darren, as a jockey, you rode two winners, Inspired and Guineas. If you had to draw a barrier, what would it, what would you draw? Gate one, any day in the Golden Slipper. It's uh, it's a huge advantage to be, especially on a two-year-old. I know you'll be, you're in the gates a long time, uh, but in saying that, it's an advantage where you can basically put your horse where the horse uh, races in its racing pattern. So, gate one's ideal. Yeah, and of course, microphone. You drew it out of the gate, uh, out of the barrier, barrier one. Yes, um, I said to James before I left this morning after track work, hopefully we can draw inside eight on all of them. So four out of six ain't too bad. Um, but uh, look, you know, every horse of ours has got a super chance. As we say, you've ridden two winners, but what's it like to build up this week on the other side of the fence, so to speak, and taking through each day the nerves and so forth? It's a whole different feel being on the other side of the fence, um, part of the training operation. and. Um, working under James um, and watching him see him put them through their paces and doing different little things with them. Um, even you know, bringing microphone out here a couple of weeks ago just for a race day outing and a float trip so he's, he's prepared for uh, Golden Slipper Day on, at, at Rose Hill. So little things like that can make a huge difference to a horse's performance. Yeah, you feel much more part of it being in the position I'm in now. And you were a young fellow when you won the slipper first on Inspired. How did it change your life? What do you remember about it changing your life at that moment? Yeah, well, it was a life-changing experience. Um, it was my first group race, let alone be a Group 1 race that I rode in. And, um, you know, my boss, um, Theo Green, uh, had faith in me to put me on. And I used to strap the horse and muck out his box every morning. So it was a bit of a Tommy Woodcock far lap um, uh, association. So... Uh, yeah, it, I really didn't realise how big it was until you'd had a, a few rides in the race and, and watched the race over the years. But, um, yeah, that no, was a huge thrill. Good luck to you and all the team with all of the runners on Saturday. Good. Thanks, Brett.